Now, some people don't eat fish and seafood, um, and they want to get their omega-3s, the anti-inflammatory fats, from plant foods. They can do that, and you'll often hear uh, different things on the web or news reports that will tell you that you can get these from things like avocado and even from leafy greens. And that is totally true. It's just that you have to eat a whole lot more of them to get the same bioactive level as you would get in fish or seafood. For people that are eating only plant foods and getting all their omega-3s from plants, they just need to eat a larger volume. And what you're seeing on this slide here is if you think about 500 milligram equivalent, um, you're needing about three tablespoons of ground flaxseed, which some people, you know, they might have a smoothie every day and, and get their omega-3s from flax. So it's just to remember that you need a little more um, to get the biologically active amount. Um, it does take about 26 avocados um, <laughs> to get the equivalent of um, 500 milligrams of EPA and DHA. So, you know, unless you have an avocado tree in your backyard, it's unlikely that that's gonna happen. Those are really healthy choices, and so are dark green leafy vegetables. Um, it's just that they're not as biologically active as the kind that we actually get in fish and seafood.